syrup dishes camping again. We've got our uh, cast iron Dutch oven and my man Jason Southern Boy puts together an optimal peach cobbler using some peaches, cake batter, cinnamon butter, and some uh, charcoal briquettes. It is phenomenal. Check out this video I'm putting it together. So we laid out the briquettes. You're gonna have less on the bottom than top. We did 12 underneath, 14 on top. Go ahead and give that a whirl. Uh, you can find recipes for how many charcoal briquettes to use with your cast iron Dutch oven online. Uh, we may have to add some later on. It depends on how long they burn. You gotta buy good charcoal bri briquettes. Don't go to that dollar discount and buy them cheap ones. You gotta get the good stuff. Stay tuned. Took a look at it it is still not crispy we're gonna add some more briquettes underneath and make sure that this sucker is getting up to temperature you want it boiling all around nice and crispy brown on top All right, guys, we're gonna check the cobbler one more time. You can obviously see it's boiling really good. That's what we wanna see, but we wanna see that nice crisp top on it. Because if you don't have a crispy top, it's worthless. It doesn't taste very good. Almost there. Just Five a more few more minutes yeah. and we'll have her win. added some coals to the top of it just to make sure we wanted to get that crispy top on the top layer there. It's looking real good. I think we're ready to have some peach top. All right, there you go, peach cobbler coming at you from a Dutch oven. My man Jason's got the recipe. It's so easy and good to make. Our 14 year old girls put it all together. They do a phenomenal job. You can mix it up with blueberries, apples, uh, huckleberries, whatever you're looking for. It's delicious. Stay tuned for more syrup dishes videos. <laughs>